this example, we consider the given relation as a set of the order pairs 3, negative 4, 3, negative 3, 3, 1, negative 1, negative 5. In part A, we are going to determine the domain and range for the relation. Let's use the notation D to represent the domain. The notation R to represent the range. D or the domain is the set of the first coordinates, which are 3 and negative 1. R or the range of this relation is the set of the second coordinates, which are negative 4, negative 3, 1, negative 5. In part B, we determine if the relation is a function, if not, and we call it to other case as proof. The relation is a function if and only if the first co coordinate is mapping to exactly one number of the second coordinate. If we look at the mapping way, the first coordinate three maps with negative four. The first coordinate three also maps with negative three and one. The negative one maps with negative five. This part will show that this relation is not a function. We can say that this Actually, there are three other pairs that shows that the first coordinate maps to three different numbers. If you plot on the xy plane, three negative four, three negative three, three positive one, negative one, negative five, These three coordinates shows that it did not pass the vertical line test. Let's look at another example. For this part, the problem gives you the graph as the graph of the circle. We determine the domain and the range for this relation in the interval notation. Domain as the set of the first coordinate or the set of parts of the x value. The range or the notation R represent the set of the second coordinates or the y values. For this graph, for the x value would be anywhere from negative one to positive one, where the y value could be anywhere from positive two to positive four. In the interval notation, the domain is in the form of the interval negative one and one inclusive. And the range would be the interval from positive two to positive four inclusive. Next part, we determine if the relation is a function. If not, identify two other pairs as proof. From the graph, we can use the vertical line test. For the vertical line test, if we draw any vertical line and we have more than one intersection point, as we see in this case, we can see the two intersection point. For example, the order pair, zero, four, and the order pair zero, two, they are on the same vertical line. 
we can use those two order pairs as examples to verify that this relation is not a function. So we say the relation is not a function because the graph does not pass the vertical line test and the two order pairs as the proof would be the order pair zero four and zero two. 